Hi, my name is Britt Spears. I'm a certified prosthetist orthodist and a fellow of the American Academy of Orthodist and Prosthetist. Today's discussion is on prosthetic socks. Prosthetic socks, the standards that they come in are one ply, which are very thin, three ply, which are equal to three of the one plies, and five plies, which are equal to five of the one plies. These come in several different styles. Some of them are wool, some of them are spandex material, and some of them are basically nylon or cotton. These are basically up to the patient's preference. The majority of the ones that I use in my practice are called soft and cuddly, which are a variation of nylon with spandex. They tend to hold next to the leg much better. Um, prosthetic socks also come in various other non-standard sizes such as 2, 4, 6, 7, 8, and 9 ply socks. These are for people that have been in a prosthesis for a long time and don't really vary their sock fit much. Now with that said, the majority of amputees when they go to bed at night, for example, they may be in a five ply fit. In the first, in the morning, first thing, they're generally going to be puffed up a little bit. Um, so they will not start out with that five ply. They may have to start out with two ones and then build up to five. And the way they would do that would be two one plies, then it, when they get ready to get up to the three, as they're adding plies and fitting in the prosthetic socket properly, they would take off the two and use a, utilize a three, always putting the thicker sock next to the limb. The, then as they add, they would add another one, which would bring them up to four ply. And then once they get up to the five ply level, they would take all of those off and utilize a five ply. The ideal fit is to utilize the maximum number of um, ply with the least number of socks. Always having the thicker sock next to the limb because the thinner socks tend to get wrinkles and wrinkles are not your friend inside that fit. Now washing prosthetic socks, you would wash them in like a mild detergent soap such as Woolite. You would rinse them out real well and then you would just stick them on basically your shower rack um, and let them drip dry and air dry. Prosthetic socks, um, usually you would have a set to wash and a set to wear. So you would be able to interchange those between days. Um, depending on your suspension style, you might not have to change prosthetic socks as often. Um, that is all of today's discussion on prosthetic socks. Thank you.